Hey guys, how's it going? Daniel here. So of course today we are here checking an awesome new app that I have been using now for a while and that app is Sofa. So Sofa is a great app that allows you to track a lot of your favorite stuff that you like to do in your downtime from playing video games, listening to podcasts, reading books, movies, TV shows, um, you name it, you could track a lot of stuff within Sofa. So let's check out the app. So th this is how it looks, of course, in light mode is the app. It's really nice and simple. And uh, like I said, it's just a really, really fantastic app to track a lot of stuff down. So let's take a look at the app. So first of course, we have the section here called the pile. So in the pile here is pretty much stuff that if you're in a hurry or something, you're out and about or you just are being lazy and you don't want to organize uh, your stuff right now, then you can add that stuff to the pile and you can organize it later. So here, of course, you get to add what well, here you get to do keep. So here you get to either log it into the activity or add them to your list. So since this is an app, I can add it to my app list and it will automatically be moved as you can see to the app list. So if I go to my app list, it will be right there waiting for me as well. Next, we have the activity section. So in the activity section, of course, here you can log how much time you've spent uh, doing whatever you've been doing on your phone or if you've been watching a TV show, using an app and everything, you can log that time all in here in your activity section. And then the shelf is a pretty much a fun little area where you can add stuff that you're currently doing right now or what's up next on your list. So like, the new TV show Outer Banks that came out season two last night. I've been watching that right now, so that's the sh uh, that's the thing that added uh, I added on my list right now. And of course, as you can see in uh, for review is the sofa downtime organizer. So what I am doing right now in this video. And so yeah, it's just a really really great way just to add whatever your stuff, whatever you're tracking on your downtime, in a nice organized way. So here, of course, you get to add them here. If you want to add a new item, you can add a new item. So let's say you want to add a new item to the uh, app section. Let's uh, you can search for whatever app you're looking for in the app store, which is always really awesome about this app is that you can actually search a lot of stuff like that in the app store. So let's try, let's try Metro, one of my favorite. Uh, games on the ISO and because it's not here since there's a lot of apps called Metro uh, I do use this app whenever I need to so I either add it to the pile I can see right there if I too lazy in a rush to add it directly into my app list or I can if I have time of course go to the app list and just click on it and there we go it's added to my app list of uh, apps that I'm currently uh, using right now and just apps that I really like using as well. So yeah, as you see, I've been tracking a lot of stuff, of course, TV shows right here, uh, books, uh, video games, whenever I get time to play them right here as well. And podcasts, as you see, it's, only, it's not a lot of podcasts. Uh, I try to keep mine limited a little bit. So yeah, podcast is right there. Now, another favorite feature of mine about this application is that when you click on an app, so uh, not in an app, I mean, but on a show or something like that. So let's just go and click Outer Banks. So here, of course, you get to either add sticky notes. So sticky notes, of course, is it allows you to add uh, some quick information about maybe a podcast or an app or something, a quick little notes on it so that you remember what you want to talk about or something, or you just want to remember something in that episode of a podcast um, that you could quickly add sticky notes onto the uh, onto the w whatever you're watching, listening, or reading as well. And then what's also awesome is that you get to do a lot more information. So like if we go to the app list, let's go to side notes here. Here you get to do a lot of reading, of course, of what's in the app store. You're reading about the app as well right here. And then what's also awesome is that you can also check, uh, you can actually open up directly to the app store or to the developer's site as well. And you get to see uh, a lot more information as well. So the app is free to download, but there is an in-app subscription purchase that allows you to do a lot of the uh, pro features. So one of the big pro features, of course, is themes. So with themes, of course, uh, you can either buy them. If you download the app for free, you could buy each theme individually um, as well if you don't want to pay for the in-app subscription. But with the in-app subscription, you get to unlock all the themes as well. 
um, you get to unlock the shelf here. So here you get to track whatever you're doing what at this very moment as well. Um, if for the uh, like for the descriptions, um, when in the free version you get only like the basic um, the basic information about that certain thing that you're currently doing right now and then the pro future unlock unlocks pretty much this stuff right here where you can open up the links and everything as well from here and also it also unlocks sticky notes as well so if you're if you want to write more sticky notes then you have to of course uh keep adding more sticky notes like that you get to um how do you call it you have to unlock that in the in-app subscription as well so that's pretty much it for this app uh, about my, one of my new favorite apps on iOS. Um, it's been out now for a very long time. Uh, but yeah, I just this app is just a really, really great app to just track a lot of my stuff that I like to do so from finding apps. I use this app pretty much as a like app wish list type of thing to check out new apps and everything and track a lot of my TV shows, of course, that I've been watching as well. And yeah, it's just a really, really great way just to track a lot of stuff that you are doing uh, and listening to as well. So if you guys enjoyed this video as much as I did, it will mean uh, the world to me if you guys will hit that subscribe button as well. Hit the like button. And as always, I will see you guys later. Peace.